We've made our biggest mistakes in hiring people, getting the right team together. Uh, we've listened to peep, uh, psychiatrists and uh, profile analysis, the whole story. Lately, people don't impress me by doing their job properly. They impress me when they take initiative. So in our interviews, we look for that, people who can take initiative. Technical knowledge is a given. And then, very important, can that person fit into our team culture? People make the difference, the right people. I think in the book, Good to Great, uh, they put it in, in, in a very proper way. If they say you must lead people, guide people, teach people. The moment you have to tightly manage people, you have the wrong people on board. So we went through the whole rigmarole of, of a profile analysis and personality A will work well with you and, and we don't do that anymore. You, we listen to our gut feel and then we, the last question we ask around the table is can this specific person stand around a barbecue with a glass of wine together with the rest of the team? And then you say yes or no. Technical knowledge is a given. Um, people don't impress me by doing their job. They impress me by taking initiative. I think you must play people according to their strengths. And um, I've challenged my staff a while ago on training. And, um, for, and they said, no, everything is in place. Induction training, safe health and safety. In the end, in my mind, that is not training. And as a team, we've decided going forward is how you mentor somebody, how you take him or her to a next level, create opportunities. If you don't expose yourself, you will never grow.